Hi and welcome to Gardenville.tv. We're showing you the most unusual plant. Susan. This is, uh, Catherine, this is Cleanthus punicius, the lobster claw. And I don't know whether the camera can pick it up, but these are extraordinary shaped flowers there, which resemble lobster claws. Now, it does like full sun. In fact, growing on a sheltered wall is probably the best thing. You can train it as a climber. There's also a white variety. Uh, Cleanthus punicius alba um, and that's about it needs it's happy with dry soil any garden soil but do grow it on a warm sunny wall now would this grow very large Susan no because if you're growing it on a trellis or something you can train it in tie it in cut out any stuff that's coming towards you so really it makes a very good climber um, it is evergreen and uh, it flowers sort of May, June. It's very early here now because this is a very sheltered spot and we've had an incredibly mild winter. What about feeding it? Nothing specific. I mean, if it's very dry or something in the summer, give it a water, give it a liquid feed. Anything will benefit from a, a certain amount of feeding. No harm to give it a mulch in the spring. And what but, about pruning it? As I say, if you want to train it on the wall, you're going to be cutting out um, branches that are growing out from the wall. You're going to be training other ones in, you know, tying them into a trellis and things. So you're really, you're controlling it. There's nothing specific needed, but you're controlling it as you want it. Would you recommend it for a small garden? Yes, it would be fine in a small garden, because there again, you can cut, out, cut back and cut out bits that are in your way. So it'd make an excellent sort of climber for a small garden. Would you use something like this for a vase in the house to cut the I'm flowers out? I'm not sure. I don't think you would because I think they droop so much it would be very hard to actually put it into a, into a, a, something, a flower arrangement. I have to say it's a great name, isn't it? Lobster claw, yeah. Absolutely. So and it looks like that. I wonder is it the prettiest thing you've ever seen? It's unusual. It's interesting. I, I think if you're interested in unusual plants and it's an easy thing to remember, a lobster claw. Yeah, exactly. C easily available? Fairly readily available. You might have to order it. You won't necessarily walk into somewhere and find it just straight off. Right, there you go at Gardenville.tv. Join us on Facebook and Twitter. Until the next time.